What's going on guys, Phantasm Mask, and bringing you the obligatory PS4 unboxing. Now this was the box that Amazon shipped out, which you can't really get very many good shots with this, at this angle, so let me just back up for a second. This box is a little bit dinged up. When this was on my doorstep, uh, I was getting a little bit concerned at the really, really bad packaging job that they did for the exterior, so I hope everything on the inside is alright. The only thing I've done so far is just open up this box for the sake of saving time. So I'll set this down over to the side and move us back on down. Please excuse the wires and like the bag over there. Hit the comic book store earlier and uh, capture equipment and things like that. So, what a wrap. All right, let's actually get in here. Let's pull it right on out. Damn, this is a big box. So, right off the bat, Battlefield 4. So, can't wait to pop this in and play it. And Jet Black PlayStation 4, 500 gigabyte hard drive. On the back, you know, the best place to play. You know, I'm sure a lot of people will contest that, but let's actually open this thing up. Let's see, definitely reminiscent of the PlayStation 2 packaging that I had way back in the day. See, all right. Here's the official PlayStation seal. I know this is pretty bad. Look, I should probably pay more attention to what's going on on the camera. There's a nice PlayStation seal here. Let's see, I don't know where my box cutter ran off to. So, all right. up here. At least the box on the inside wasn't damaged too much, so let's see. Should turn this around and open it up the other way. And there it is. PlayStation 4. Let's get this on up. Let's get this car off here. Alright. Wow, look at that. That is a nice finish here. Let's see. This is the, get the back with all the ports. AC, HDMI, and Ethernet up in there. You got the very front here. USB ports and the power switch and the eject disk switch. We'll gently set this off to the side over here. And... Uh, special offers from PlayStation and it's got codes in here so I'm not going to show what exactly the uh, is inside here but listed it has a 30-day trial for PlayStation Plus a 30-day trial for Music Unlimited and ten dollars to get started on the PlayStation Store which I'll probably be using towards Battlefield 4 Premium your quick start guide the uh, extremely cheap looking mono headset. This is probably the weakest part of the PlayStation 4 is that they just put this I mean it even looks really really cheap. Uh, this is supposed to be a headset basically an earbud with a small microphone on it. I'm not too impressed with that hoping to replace this pretty soon. Set that off to the side. Your AC cord. This looks like your adapt your micro USB adapter to charge your DualShock 4. And a, an HDMI cable, which, I mean, I know the Wii U were the first ones to start handing out HDMI cables, but this is always nice. I'm so glad that with the new console generation, we're finally getting HDMI cables with our consoles. And last but not least, I think, is the DualShock 4. Which I'm going to actually take this out of the package and get a good feel on it. I've been wanting to hold this for quite some time. And already I can tell you that this feels great in your hand. This is, I mean, the touchpad right there. It's similar to the Vita material for the uh, touchscreen on the back. It's a little bit bigger than the DualShock 3, and those triggers, wow. The bumpers feel great. Share and option buttons feel good. There's the back, the light on the front. Nice shot of the, uh, and this is all shiny in here because it's got the, uh, still got some plastic over the top of it. 
prevent any dirt from getting in. So I can't wait to uh, get get this plugged in, get it ready to go. Um, pretty, this is pretty much part one of my PlayStation 4 launch series. So about a about two days, I'll probably have my first impressions up of the PlayStation 4. So until then, hope you enjoyed this unboxing. Phantasm Mask here, signing out.